So I wanted to do a video about plastic bags because I'm kind of obsessed about not getting them from the stores um, and reusing them when I do get them. So for example, if I buy mangoes, I'll hold on to the bag and what I'll do is I'll put, you know, meat garbage in it and save it in the fridge and then toss it later. I normally keep and reuse our Ziploc bags and I put them back in here. Um, so um, if you use my Ziploc bags, that's totally fine. I've got a bunch of them in the pantry, but I'd love for you to wash them and reuse them, unless they're disgusting, in which case, just get rid of it. It depends on, um, you know, the condition of the bag. So um, these drying racks I typically use to dry the bags. And then when they're dry, I put them back in the drawer for reuse, uh, unless they're ripped or, like I said, just too filthy to bother with. Um, and everything here goes bad really quickly. So I buy bread at the shop and only keep it out on the counter for maximum two days because it'll start going moldy beyond that. So you'll want to put it in the fridge um, soon thereafter. Mm. Coffee maker is pretty much standard normal. You just fill that up there. Uh, we keep our coffee in this container and we reuse this container and we, we buy coffee and just refill this and inside the container is the scoop uh, so uh, I think we like coffee a little on the stronger side so we just do sort of rounded uh, spoonfuls into the the filter and this thing I don't know what it's called and then um, I think the clock on this is all messed up at any rate you could just start it um, on and off I don't know how everything else on there works and I, I try to keep this open in the day so that the moisture doesn't sit and, uh, you know, I want it to dry out so it doesn't get bacterial growth. 